Nine of the 10 leading causes of death in the United States are either not only just caused by food and lifestyle, but are directly attributable to dysfunctional blood sugar or are worsened by wow. elevated blood really? sugar. Nine of the 10. So we're looking at things like Alzheimer's dementia, which is now being called, called type three diabetes because it's so related to blood sugar, heart disease, type two diabetes, cancer is very much driven by blood sugar, chronic kidney disease, which is very much a problem of the small vessels in the kidney becoming narrowed in part because of metabolic dysfunction and erratic blood sugar control. Control. Chronic lower respiratory infections of one of the leading causes of death. And we know that people with unstable elevated blood sugar have much higher mortality, even with something like influenza or pneumonia. Having high blood sugar can get into the fluid of the lung and feed the bacteria that leads to some of these um, issues. There's some odd ones on there too. For instance, suicide is actually on the top 10 list of killers in the United States. And people with, with diabetes or metabolic dysfunction actually have higher risk of suicidality. Really? So it's all across. Huh. Uh, the board 